everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you're all really well and staying safe if you're new around here my name is jess and today we are going to be having a look at some baby shower gift ideas so i am currently 35 weeks pregnant <laughs> i am feeling very very large now and hence why i'm in my slouchies today literally nothing fits me anymore but <laughs> that's okay so I thought it would be quite nice to put together a short video just picking out five things that I think would make a really nice baby shower gift for a mum to be of course these do not need to be just for a baby shower gift they could just be a gift for a new mum and I'm sure they would be very gratefully received so I have picked out five things that I think would make a really, really nice gift, either to yourself or from someone else if you are looking to buy for a new mum-to-be. I personally have bought some of these things for myself. Some of them I have also been very kindly sent from lovely businesses over on Instagram. So I will link everything down below for you if you would like to shop it. So without any more waffling, let's get into the video and find out what these things are. So the first item is this, it's called Spritz for Bits. Now this is very, very popular at the moment. It's from my expert midwife and Spritz for Bits is perfect for women after birth. So it's something that you will use on your bits and um, you can either spray it but you can also pop it on like a sanitary towel or something and pop that in the fridge and it's just really cooling and nourishing on your bits um, as if you've had a baby before you may know you might need something like this and um, yeah at the moment this is one of the number one things that people are recommending and using just for that instant relief so this would make a fantastic gift for someone. Next up I've got this candle. This candle is called Mother and it's from a company called Ring Sling. Um, I absolutely love this company. They make the most gorgeous ring slings for baby and they make little um, toys as well, little knitted toys. So when I saw that they had a candle I had to get it. This candle is for people who are in the final stages of pregnancy so any time from kind of 36 to 37 weeks onwards it's something that you could use um either at home or you could actually potentially use it in hospital as well um it's got loads of lovely essential oils in it so it's full of bergamot clary sage lavender sandalwood and vanilla they recommend using it in the final stages just because of the sage as that can induce, um, <laughs> it can induce labour and no one wants to go into early labour so yes yeah, save it and it's something that you would use later on. The packaging is just so pretty, the packaging is just really lovely and I think it would make such a beautiful gift for a mum to be, something that she can just light and in the evening sit and enjoy and just relax really I think yeah what a beautiful gift that would make. So typically when you have a baby shower or if you are buying a gift for a mum to be you quite often will get them something really that's actually for the baby or to be used on the baby so I thought this video would be quite nice as it's actually just things that would be really nice for a mum and something that I have been more conscious of recently is my skincare so I invested in some products from Bobbi Brown and these would actually make a really really nice gift for a new mum especially this one here so this is the extra eye repair cream from Bobbi Brown and you get quite a good amount I've obviously been using it quite a lot already but you just pop a little bit on your ring finger warm it up between your two fingers and then dab 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 under your eyes every night and every morning and I have to say I've really noticed a difference in my eyes and I actually saw this being recommended by another new mum over on Instagram and I thought she has a point this is needed she said she purchased hers after she'd had her baby and she was lying in hospital and thinking wow I'm never gonna get any sleep ever again and I'm forever going to have black rings around my eyes and I thought yes 
you're right you are um so i i bought this for myself but again it would make a really really lovely gift for a mum to be another gift idea that i had which i haven't actually got to hand is a gift card to use at a coffee shop now i know places like starbucks and costa offer gift cards and i think this would be such a fantastic gift for a new mum because with potentially the lockdown lifting we are going to be able to go out more and more to, as new mummies to go and do what new mums do which is go and chat and talk about our babies and talk about how tired we are so i thought it'd be really nice to get a gift card for someone so that they can go to the coffee shop and buy some coffee and not have to pay for it i just think it would be a really really nice thoughtful gift and something that they can use over and over again hopefully depending on obviously how much money you put on the gift card but either way even if it's one coffee or two coffees i'm sure they will absolutely enjoy that treat so the last item that i've got to share with you is this pre-packed hospital bag now this would be the most amazing gift it might be something that you would buy individually or maybe as a group of friends buying for a friend who is pregnant you could club in together or if you're another half and you'd like to buy your pregnant wife, girlfriend, partner a, a, a present, this would be amazing and I'm sure they would love it because I'm so excited to use this. So it comes in this beautiful canvas bag. It's from a company called Something A Bit Different. I will link this below. And inside you get so many fantastic things. Everything that you could possibly need for going into hospital to have your baby. So the first, so let's have a look what's inside. Starting off, you've got a really lovely silk eye mask and it's really soft. And I could just imagine using this like when I'm trying to get some sleep before baby arrives, if that's possible, if you're having maybe a c-section or if you're having to stay in hospital after baby and you're staying on a ward this could potentially be a lifesaver you have got some you've also got some sanitary towels essential there's a little pamper kit here and inside you get some lovely like face moisturizers eye creams face scrub all of that so you don't have to take any of your kind of big bulky things with you you just have it all in little sachets so that's perfect you've also got a small travel size nipple cream which is fantastic if you're breastfeeding then there is a flannel with um, a nice lollipop wrapped up inside just to give you that little bit of energy and sugar rush that you might need when in labor and it will and the flannel itself is super soft and it would be perfect for kind of either keeping cool and like patting your head or for after you've had your baby just giving yourself a nice wash down in the showers this is essential there's also some really cute things in here for baby too so it comes with a pair of cute little boots how cute and snuggly are they and then a little hat a little cotton hat and some scratch mix in a very neutral color so if you don't know if you what you're having or if you're having a boy or a girl this these will suit both genders you also get a detachable wash bag in here and it's got again more things that you will need like a toothbrush there's a comb some Vaseline for when your lips get dry. I know my lips got really dry when I was giving birth to my first daughter. Um, some nice spray to kind of like calm you down and also just to create a lovely relaxing environment. There's some cotton pads, soap, toothbrush, a hairband, absolutely essential. And also some um, face halos, which are lovely just for washing your face and stuff like that. So yeah, that's really cute. There's also obviously um, shampoo, conditioner, body wash and everything else inside your wash bag. And then underneath you've got more things. It's like a bag that just keeps on giving. So underneath you've then got all of this. So we've got some um, bamboo baby wipes some disposable nappy sacks. Again, all these products are really eco-friendly, which I like as well. 
There's some tiny nappies to you get one, two, three, four, five nappies. You get a good amount of nappies in there. There's a beautiful swaddle blanket with this kind of gorgeous botanical pattern on it and a pair of squidgy slippers. Now, if you haven't been to hospital before and you're having a baby, squidgy slippers or just any kind of slippers are a really, really good idea because you can then kind of walk around the hospital, get baby moving or even afterwards, just kind of walking around, going to the showers, etc. Perfect. And the last thing that you do get in the bag, but I've already started wearing because mine doesn't fit me anymore, is a lovely, super snuggly and soft dressing gown. And the cutest thing is that it says mummy on it. And I just think this is a really nice touch. And it all fits very, very nicely into that bag. I think what I love about the bag is the fact that it has everything in there that you would need. So if you got caught off guard for any reason, you could literally grab a bag and away you go, knowing that you are packed and ready so well actually one of my jobs over the next few days is to pack my hospital bag like officially with like an outfit for baby etc and all of these items are going to be included in that bag so this brings me to the end of my gift ideas for a baby shower or for a mum to be i hope you found it really helpful and you have enjoyed it if you have any comments or if you would like to shop any of it please check out everything down below and until next time, stay safe and take care. Bye.